This train moans, a dizzy, narcotic howl. Toward eyes you would swear belong to the devil, round and burning green and homicidally radiant. This train swung tire irons and chains and broke the mirrors of an American face. I live nowhere near this train. I live in Ukrainian village, but I too have a nemesis, a built-in enemy that I must observe. She is small, but ferocious. She is five foot one. She is Ukrainian lady. It all started when I got my dog, Chooch. I adopted him for paws, and he gives me such pleasure. One day I'm walking him down the street toward the Ukrainian lady's house, and she goes, Show me a little bag for dog mess, Mr. Big Shop, Mr. Ackler. I'll pull out my CVS plastic bag and show it to her. No flies on me, baby. I'm good. How do you know I'm an actor? She goes, well, I caught your marvelous performance yesterday in my front yard. She goes, when you bend over and pinch up your face and pretend to pick up dog mess, you look around so slick, but I'm not stupid. I'm not Pollock. I wait for you to leave. I run down the steps, and there it is. Big pile. Still steaming, Eden. She had me. Now she follows me every single morning. 50 feet behind me. Not 60, not 40. 50 feet. Hectoring me the whole way. She says, I hear you are also poet, Mr. Big Shot. I too wrote poetry, wrote haiku poem, just for you. Soviet wall comes down. Oh, joy. Idiot on the other side. Mean. Mean as a snake. The only word she's ever said to stop is asshole. Every morning I pick up after Chooch, I knock the bag, I show it to her. She goes, very good, big shot. Now go to your little store and make your crazy man pictures. 